What's up guys, it's Hubs, and this is the next video in the series. Um, my video is about the Unholy Tower. This video is on floor 61 to 70. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and then find a friend unit. Apparently I only have one friend available. I don't know why. Why would you do this to me? I guess we'll use this guy. Fire and light types. Okay, light types. Um, let's go ahead and use my light team then. I don't want to use this team in particular. Let's swap out some people. If I can. Or will I? I don't know. I really like this guy. He's not even a 6 star. Hmm. Oh, if I sound tired, it's because I just woke up. Um, yeah. It's been like 6 or 7 hours since I did the last video. And I am still tired. Uh, okay, looks like I don't have anything else to use right now. I have like M or Atro. Well, man, my Atros don't even have Brave Burst, uh, Super Brave Burst unlocked. But I would rather use this animal one than that 5 star Ramaldria, or however you say his name. But yeah, I'll go with this party. And as for Spheres, um, I don't think any of them have anything equipped on them. Um, equipped on them yeah uh, yeah that's awesome because yeah the the only friend I had was the fire goddess and her leader skill gives a boost to fire and light types oh so maybe I guess I could have made a fire and light team that would have been better um, but this is probably going to be the last video where I use um, just any random team because I hear this is about the time um, or at least in the next uh, the next level which is, and it costs 25 energy too, I heard the difficulty starts ramping up a little bit, because um, as you can see now, the difficulty still seems pretty easy, uh, just, I mean, they don't do any damage to me, so, and, yeah, as I said before in other videos, it, it seems that in, from floor 1 to now, they basically stay the same in terms of difficulty, or maybe everything, maybe like a ballpark estimate is, Everything that costs 15 energy, or um, so stages like 1 to 10, 21 to, or 11 to 20, any, anything that costs 15 energy probably is about the same difficulty, and then when it starts costing 20 energy, that's probably the same difficulty, and then the next stage after this, it costs 25 energy, so I would assume that would be in its own level of difficulty. Um, I've heard people said they, they've actually started wiping on, when I say wipe, I mean they lose all their units. Um, in the later stages. But it looks like we actually encountered him again. Maybe we can actually capture him this time. So I'm going to activate my Melchio's BB first, just because um, he gives that in a status ailment resistance. Um, and if you haven't seen, or I've said this in a previous video, I think, um, when I'm going through this, but when you activate um, someone's, or a Bright Burst that buffs you, it takes, it becomes into effect immediately right after the animation of the very first like when I say animation I mean when the when the unit appears on your screen and does like the whole you see the name of the brave burst and then it finishes right after that it's already active so you don't need to wait um, for anything like if the buff also has like an animation um, like Elimo's defense buff with the heal you don't need to actually wait for the heal to finish for the buff to take into effect So I can probably be in next turn, hopefully. Divine Blaster. Please capture, please capture. God damn. That was the third time I saw him and no capture. I'm probably gonna have to use a couple gems to capture him later. Oh, but that was on that was on round three. Normally I've been seeing him on like the fifth round of the stages. I guess it's possible to see him on any any level or maybe it's like in increments like three five seven and ten but i don't really know this is just kind of gumi's way of saying you need to run this dungeon a minimum of ten times to get the gem because everyone has just been running um 
the last stage in all the events. Like, for example, when the Battle Maidens came out, I never ran level 1 or 2. I only ran level 3, because you can get the gem right away from level 3. And if you're strong enough to beat it, it's better anyways, because the capture rate is higher. So all, like, the top players would just run level 3 for it, for the Battle Maidens. And then same thing happened when um, we got the Goddesses, like, a week ago. Everyone just ran level 4 if they could, got the gem, and then life was good. But I guess for this um, Vortex, they're like, no, you need to spend a minimum of energy to finish um, 10, 10 kind of battles, or 10 levels of it, um, to get your gem, and to also unlock the highest difficulty where he's probably the easiest to capture. I'm okay with this, though, because, I mean, I like the idea of, like, going up the tower, um, and I don't know, like, depends, depends what people like, uh, I personally like it, if you don't, you know, you should leave a comment, say why you don't like it, I, I'd be interested to see why, but I think for the most part, people probably will enjoy this kind of thing, so I don't think we're probably, we're probably not going to encounter him again, um, I don't know if you can encounter him multiple times, unfortunately, I mean, capture him again, but I mean, I'm confident that I'll get him eventually, and I'm confident that eventually I'll get an animal one. It's like, my buddy Momo, every single time he runs like these dungeons, so for the goddess dungeons, uh, he only ran each one once to get the gem, and every single time, like, before he runs it, he types in our group chat, guys, guess which type of um, goddess I'm going to get this time, and he's like, oh, don't worry, I'm definitely going to get an animal one, and there's been times where he'll just like, run it for the first time, and he's like, guys, I already know I'm going to capture it. And he, and he goes in, he beats it, he captures it, and he's like, guess what, I got Anima type, just as I predicted. I mean, he doesn't, he doesn't always do it, but when he does do it, it it's pretty funny. Like, just, And it's kind of sad sometimes, because I'll have already like done the dungeon five, six times, and I haven't caught anything. And he's just like, I'm going to get Anima, it's no big deal, you know, don't worry about it. And he gets it. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't spend too much time leveling up my uh, Brave Burst for my Light Squad. So I'm pretty sure all these guys are a Brave Burst 1. Like, my Holy Guard Will is only level 50 as well, because I just evolved him. He doesn't have Super Brave Burst. No SBB on Atro. My Lilith is like BB1. It's a very neglected team. But eventually I have them up there. Yeah. So, let's see. The Zell and Karma have gone up a little bit since... I mean level 1. I guess it's like double now, which it's it's not a lot. The items are kind of St. Lamia tier now, with red claws and red bones and stuff. So that's probably about the difficulty of this now, St. Lamia level. Um, yeah, but it should start ramping up now, I think. Um, if I take a look at... So yeah, that's 25 energy now. So I'm going to end this video right here, and then my next video is going to be on floor 71 to 80.